I dare you to tell me that NBA is not rigged after watching this video. Once again, I decode the script of a professional basketball game. Boston Celtics versus Miami Heat. Here's my pre-game code. Boston love 22. And if they win today, the series will become 2-2. In Gematria, Boston gets you 22. Miami Heat equals 79 in Gematria, the 22nd prime. Jimmy Butler is Miami's best player. He wears the number 22. Today leaves 222 days left in the year. This game was 22 days after the anniversary of the Illuminati being founded and also Gianna Bryant's 16th birthday, May the 1st. Today's date can be written 23-5. Kobe Bryant was born on the 235th day of the year and his highest scoring game was on the 22nd day of 2006, which is ironically the year that Gianna Bryant was born and we're told that Kobe and Gianna died on January the 26th, 2020 in a helicopter crash. Never happened. Today's the 143rd day of the year. Kobe was born on 823 and 823 is the 143rd prime. I knew this game was all about him and I'll prove it to you. Today's date can also be written 523, May the 23rd. 523 is the 99th prime. I keep talking about the number 99. Ever since Prince Philip died at age 99 on the 99th day of the year. So Kobe's highest scoring game was 81 points, which he got in his 666 game. And nine times nine gets you 81. Kobe and Gematria gets you 75. And Miami Heat got their 75th road loss in the playoffs. Kobe also gets you 33 in Gematria, and Boston got their 33rd home win of the season. Jason Tatum, Boston Celtics' best player, was born on 3-3, on a day leaving 303 days left in the year, and Kobe trained him, just like he trained Jimmy Butler. Kobe equals 21, and the Heat got their 21st road loss of the season. Now check out this. This was the Celtics' 122nd Eastern Conference final game, and Kobe's highest scoring game was on 1 2 2. His whole game was about him. Celtics become 5 and 3 at home in the playoffs. 53 is, of course, connected to 16 because 53 is the 16th prime number. Today's game was played on 16 date numerology. Heat in Gematria gets you 16. Boston stayed on 16 home losses. And Miami got their 16th road loss in Eastern Conference Finals games. You think all of this is coincidental? It's not. The Miami coach Spolster, he got his 63rd playoff loss. And the Heat stayed on 63 season wins. I keep talking about 63 because I think Elizabeth goes on 6-3. And at one point in this game, the score was 63-36. Like June the 3rd or the 3rd of June. Kobe retired in 2016, and 2016 is the 63rd triangular number. The Heat dropped to 5-8 and eight versus Boston on the road in the playoffs. In Gematria, Kobe Bryant gets you 58. When you type 58 into the Gematinator with letters, it gets you 61, a very big number. Boston got their 61st season win and became 61-61 all-time in Eastern Conference final games. Kobe Bryant equals 113. He was drafted round one, pick 13, and made his NBA debut on 11 3. Remember, 113 is the number of deception. 113 is the 30th prime. Miami stayed on 30 wins in Eastern Conference final games. Kobe Bryant equals 41 in Gematria, and he conveniently died at 41. The Celtics got their 41st Eastern Conference final win at home. This game was exactly 41 weeks after Boston coach's birthday. You think that is a coincidence? It's not. The Boston coach was born on 8-9. 89 is the 24th prime, which was Kobe's number the majority of his career. The Celtics got their 90th win versus the Heat all time. Monday in Gematria gets you 90. The game was played on 34 date numerology. The Heat got their 34th season loss and dropped to 3-4 and four on the road in the playoffs. 
Heat gets you 34 in Gematria. And literally the only worries I had for Miami was a 96 code. The Miami coach gets his 96 playoff win and Boston dropped to 9 and 6 in the playoffs. Queen is 96 years old and Kobe was drafted in 96, but this was all about Boston. And wait until you see the in-play code. We'll start here. So to start off this game, Boston went up 26-6. Yes, guys, Miami, who won the Eastern Conference, were down 26-6. And Kobe Bryant was drafted on 26-6. I take pride in calling scripts, guys. It was Jimmy Butler, who was trained by Kobe, who made this score 26-6, like how Kobe Bryant was drafted the 26th of June. Okay? Undeniable stuff. And look at this. This is insane. One minute, 44 seconds on the clock. I was born 14-4. The Elizabeth line opens 144th day of the year. And then look at this. 33.3% as they have 333 patrons. Truly beautiful. So that is undeniable. Okay. Now check out this timeout. I keep telling people you've got to look at the timeouts and the scores and the time they take the timeouts. That's why I won thousands of dollars in play because I know how to gamble and most people don't. So there was a timeout when the score was 40-21. Timeout with 61 points scored. Boston got their 61st season win and became 61-61 all-time in Eastern Conference Final games. Timeout with 7.33 on the clock. 7.33 is the 130th prime. Kobe Bryant was born on 8-2-3-1978 on a day leaving 130 days left in the year. Un. Deniable. And again, these NBA fans who dismiss my work, how are Miami Heat ending the first quarter on 11 points when they won the Eastern Conference? When they've won 63 games this season, they can only score 11 points in a quarter. Come on. Queen Elizabeth born on the 111th day of the year. Look at these triple ones here. And then, more undeniable work. The game was 8-1 at the beginning. 81. Okay? Kobe's highest scoring game, which I mentioned in my pre-game code. 81. His full name is 81. Kobe Bean Bryant. Kobe is massively connected to Skull and Bones. Okay? Order 3 2, two. And 322 marks the 22nd is the 81st day of the year. The word ritual gets you 81. All right? It's not a coincidence. Liverpool beat Real Madrid in the European Cup in 81. And now they're playing each other again. So like I said, today's date can be written 523. Boston went up 50-23. 523. Okay? Like today's date, May the 23rd. But 5-2-3 is the 99th prime. I've told you Kobe's highest scoring game was 81 points. Nine times nine. Kobe, who spent his whole career with the Los Angeles Lakers, who were based in California, who were founded September the 9th, 9-9. And at 50-23, guys, Boston were up by 27 points. Nine plus nine plus 9 equals 27, and 2 plus 7 gets you 9. We told in that helicopter crash involving Kobe and Gianna that 9 people died. It never happened. 8-1, guys. 9. 8 plus 1 is 9. And then the halftime score, just to confirm who was going to win. Obviously, Boston were killing it. But you never know in the rigged NBA, but with this knowledge, this was game over. Again, look at Miami Heat, 11 22. JFK died, 11 22. 11 22 and 33 are the three master numbers. Just a joke. Miami Heat, 
end the half with 33 points. Could only score 33 points in a half. Kobe equals 33. Boston get their 33rd home win of the season. Jason Tatum born on 3-3 and Kobe trained him. Of course, Jason Tatum got 31 points. More points than any other player tonight. Interesting now in the last game, Jason Tatum only scored 10 points. And in this game, he gets 31. 31 minus 10 is 21. Kobe gets you 21. Just absolutely ridiculous. Ridiculous, guys. I'm decoding the script of these games. People try and test me. 90 total points, guys, at the half. And Boston got their 90th win versus the Heat. Monday gets you 90 in Jumatria. And then the Boston coach, like I said, was born on 8-9, the 24th prime. So 89 is the 24th prime. Kobe wore 24 the majority of his career. And Boston ended the half up by 24 points. Anybody who dismisses this video is in denial. Okay? Truly in denial. And I think a lot of the people that dismiss my work dismiss it because it breaks their heart. That's why people are leaving comments in my live saying comments like this. I am still dependent on the system and its entertainment, referring to themselves, saying they are dependent on entertainment. Okay? And then somebody said, without football, I probably wouldn't be alive today. It's my release. How sad is this? How tragic is that? That without professional sports, they would be dead. So a lot of people who target me, even though my work is outstanding, it's because I am shattering their illusions. So all those NBA fans out there who are leaving me comments saying there's no way the NBA is rigged. You're going to still say that after this video? If so, then you're in complete denial. Complete denial. By the way, going back to this 1122, JFK died 1122. He was supposedly assassinated in 63. And Miami stay on 63. Season wins and their coach gets his 63rd playoff loss. Let's see what happens June the 3rd. But whatever happens June the 3rd, I am doing outstanding work and I'm going to learn to appreciate the hate. And it's going to make me stronger and better. And for the people who've left me, you're going to regret it. Woo-hoo, baby.